a problem trying to get Peter off the screen. He was just togging it, you know? And um, anyway, it's really lovely to see you all here. We're going to ask some questions to Babs. And um, I'm, I've got a bit of a, 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 a slideshow for you for, for today. Because I wanted to let you know that, you know, um, uh, Ken and I had a break for a while. I was seeing somebody else. And I thought... <laughs> Hold it together, Babs. Hold it together, Babs. Okay. So I wanted to show you a picture of me and my new boyfriend, who's an Australian surfer and his name is Blaine. That's me and Blaine. We, we fell in love after Ken and I broke up. And um, he's, 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 he's just really, well, he was really cool for a while. Then he just became a bit of a dick, you know. I just wasn't interested in him after a while. And so I had a break, and then Ken and I got back together. It was really, really nice just seeing him again and, you know, going to the beach and being in the camper van. It was, it was a lot of fun just to have him back, you know. And then um, we all kind of went to the beach for a while together, which was kind of weird. You know, I wasn't sure what was going on. I just wasn't sure whether... You know, I would be with Ken or Blaine because, I mean, they're both really good-looking blokes, you know. And then, uh, you know, Ken and we, we, we went away for a weekend and we went into the, um, we went in the camper van and um, occasionally I would find Ken and Blaine in the camper van together. And, uh, you know, last week they were coming from... They were in the camper van while I was cooking dinner, spaghetti bolognese, there it is. Yeah, it was plastic spaghetti. And we were going to suck on our crazy straws, the mango one and the strawberry. And um, anyway, they were playing cards. But like when they came out, it was really strange because they, they had like different clothes on and stuff. And, and, and Blaine wasn't wearing a shirt. I just got a feeling they were probably playing strip poker. I don't know. Anyway, so uh, anyway, that was that. And then, then we went on a holiday. Me and Ken, um, we went. To, Ken, we kind of got back together. We went to a holiday in Brazil. And it was really, really good time. Really, really good time. We just, uh, you know, rode bikes around Brazil and had a swim. But it was nice to have Ken back together again. You know, and we. We, we, while we were over there, we, we just, we kind of rekindled the relationship. We did. It was really, really beautiful. You know, he took me out to dinner. We had lots of fun and um, we, we rekindled the relationship. But well, there was, you know, there was a time where actually Blaine rolled up as well. Blaine came along and just met us in Brazil. And so I had to kind of decide who I was going to be boyfriend and girlfriend with. And it was really, really scary because, well, this is what happened. And I don't know whose it is. I really don't. So I just don't know whether I'm, you know, whether it's Ken's or, or Blaine's. Anyway, that's, that's something that we can talk about later. I'm not really interested in that now. Now we've got some questions for... Babs? Hey Babs, how do I calculate the volume of water in my corner finch tank? Well, it, what you've got to do is, is, is take the hypotenuse of the fish. If you've got seven fish, that's seven hypotenuse, and you minus that from the tank size, and then you just pour hot water in it until the, the fish kind of die and then you take the fish out and then you have enough water for it to grow in summer. Okay, next question. Hey Babs, what is the square root of 73696512285? That's from Lady Penelope. Oh, that's just easy. That's just too easy, Lady Penelope. 
The number is the square root of 736956512685. I did the calculations before, and the calculations are um, 7. Next question. Hey, Babs, what does contagious mean? Well, we really don't have enough time for that because it'd take me ages to tell, the, tell you the, what the meaning of contagious means. It's, it's you know, I've, I'm cooking dinner. I'm cooking dinner again. We're having plastic spaghetti and we've got sucking, sucking on straws. So it's going to take a while. All right, last question from Brizzy76. Hey, Babs, how will, you know, how will your life be different in a year? Hey, Babs. Oh, that's two questions, Brizzy. How would my life be different in a year? Well, I'll have a baby. I'm having a baby. Yeah, you saw that, didn't you? I'm, I'm, getting, I'm having a baby. So I don't know whose it is. That's the problem. Hey, Babs, if you could get granted all the answers of the universe, who would, would you want to know? Brizzy... I know all the answers of the universe, and that's why I have my own TV show, you bloody idiot. It's called Ask Babs, and that's why, because I know all the answers of the universe. So, all right, look, thank you, everybody, for being here. I hope you enjoyed yourself tonight. We will be back, um, I'll be back on Peter's stream very, very soon. I heard he had an alien come in. Um, I don't know what that about. What was that about, hey? Oh, God. Anyway, so thanks a lot, guys. And you, thanks for your stupid bloody questions. They're ridiculous. Why don't you ask, like, you know, personal questions like, like, uh, how do I make my man happy in the kitchen? Or on the kitchen desk? I don't know. But anyway... We will see you later again, and thank you very much for being part of the stream tonight. My name is Babs, and you can ask me questions anytime. See you later. Bye-bye. Ta-da. Bye. -bye. Ta -da. Bye. <laughs>